Very large wall displays demand the development of new interaction techniques appropriate for the format. Direct touch input, as shown here, is very natural and is excellent for developing shared understanding in collaborative settings, but it is also problematic. In particular, direct touch fails when an object of interest is out of reach. In addition to difficulties in reaching, direct touch can require a lot of physical movement and effort to complete a sequence of tasks. Here we present shadow reaching, an interaction technique that employs a user's shadow as the user's embodiment within the scene and through which the user interacts. The shadow undergoes a perspective projection relative to a real or virtual light source. This provides a user with control over their reach. By moving forwards and backwards, a user is able to control how much of the screen they can access. Observe how the user is able to reach the top of the 10-foot screen and then quickly transitions and reaches far to the right. Now watch this second user as he transitions seamlessly between localized work and distance interaction. When using shadows as an interaction metaphor, designers are not limited to single point input. Here you see an example of bimanual input. We also have a prototype employing full body input. In this prototype, we used a vision-based approach to generate virtual rendered shadows instead of using real-world shadows. Virtual shadows open up many possibilities, including the magic lens-inspired magic shadows you see here. In conclusion, shadow reaching is a powerful technique that supports natural interaction over the entirety of large display surfaces and provides strong user embodiment.